I think it's just about that time. I've actually 100% of that game in this game, but I decided to go through again, so that's what we're gonna do. You can actually, a lot of people don't know this, you can select your save file with triangle. I don't know why no one's talking about it, it literally says on the bottom right. It took 20, almost 25 hours to get the platinum. I think most people spend like 21, but I was, I was taking my time to explore this beautiful game. So with that being said, we're going to start in save slot 3. Oh, active. Oh, look at that. It shows you which one you're on. That makes sense because this game just auto-saves throughout every like two minutes. So if you guys don't know how to save, that's probably why. And when you leave the game, it will tell you how long it's been since you've last saved. With all of that being said, let's, let's start a new game. Do all that fun stuff. Actually, should we watch the introduction video so everyone knows what's going on? Nah, nah, you guys can Google it. I wish I could skip loading screens on Twitch. <laughs> I'm here just waiting for the scene to start. And here, here we go. Here we go. Three days ago, Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts, was kidnapped. Yesterday, with my help, the Psychonauts rescued Truman from the underwater lair of Dr. Lobato. But trust me, there's no way Lobato is working alone. Today, we're on a mission. Find out who hired Dr. Lobato to kidnap Truman Zanotto. My name is Raz, and today is my first official day on the job. Everything okay in here, Raz? Oh, <laughs> hey, Lily. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's just... I've dreamed about working at Psychonauts headquarters all my life. I just thought it would be more... You know? Come on! We're going to be late for the morale corral! And that's how we managed to raise profits, uh, 900% this quarter. That's right. Thank you. And that brings us to our next topic. Uh, Sasha, still have the talking turtle? Maury. Sorry, I just like the clapping. It's now time to give out the award for Employee of the Year. The prize for this year's award is an all-expenses-paid tropical vacation. Ooh! Oh, I hope it's me. The winner of this award may be one of our newest members, but he's also one of our most improved. Congratulations to... Caligosto Loboto! What? <laughs> Way to go, Cal. You're gonna love this vacation package. I'm jealous. I... I've never won anything. Or oh, been on a vacation. I don't have to go on a boat, do I? No, darling. Whew. All you need to do is get this vacation request approved by your supervisor. What? Just a formality. You just need to get this form signed by your boss. My boss? Yes, darling. Or you could just tell us who your boss is, and we could... No! Maybe he doesn't want this tropical vacation after all. 
Look, Burke, I won it. I'm Employee of the Year. Yes, you are, darling. Now off you go. Get that form signed by your boss. The person who hired you. The person you work for. Okay. Hurry up, before I take that vacation myself. Rasputin? I'm on him. Keep up with him, Raz, and he'll lead you straight to his boss. I am so excited to be playing this. Again, I was, as soon as I we'll beat try it, to I was ready to off. play it again. Be careful, darling. Stay close to him, Raz. But don't freak him out. That's inevitable. Never to act Look casual. at him. I am acting casual. What's that? I said, I love casual Friday. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Attention. The tooth is loose. Don't lose him, Raz. Oh, here we go. Picking up the pace a little bit. Uh oh. What is it? I think he suspects something. He's taking countermeasures. Just remember your basic braiding, soldier. Right. Um, if we get around to levitation, I'm going to show you guys a cool little setting you can change, but you don't have to. It just makes the whole power thing easier. Me. This was all a trick. I'm not employee of the year. I'm the greatest dentist of our century. All agents, the tooth has gone bad. Repeat, the tooth has gone bad. Maintain pursuit, Rasputin. We are in position to intercept. Roger. Yeah. You press X to Looking jump. for me? Double X well, double come jump. and get me. Why are you taking so long? Whoa. Buddy. <laughs> come back. I come don't back. think you understand the gravity of the situation <laughs> you're in. Whoa. Watch out! Hey, you're not supposed to walk that way. My posters! <laughs> My posters? Yep. Doesn't this kind of look like a design or something? Oh. That looks like a face. <laughs> hmm. They put a lot of little stuff oh. in this game for the original, like, Psychonauts yep. players. So I like to look out for all those little things. Coach! No time for small talk, soldier! The enemy is on the move! But we've got him cornered! This way! Quick! Hurry! We can't let him shake us! Now, before the procedure, it's very important that we clean out your dentist's hat. You don't want any dirty... Go away! Ah! Hold... Oh, I can... I can dodge? Sick. Oh, oh, poor, poor Coach Olean. What? <laughs> what? The fuck? I'm not cool with that. Oh, land down. Uh, figments are just collectibles. They're like kind of like coins, but they're actually beneficial. They can increase your rank. And Soldier, I've been bit. Get this giant tooth off of me! Look, he's just struggling. Soldier, extract this enemy molar. Did you say jump on the molar? Is that what you said? Did they say anything else? Lots of figments of Roboto's imagination in here. When you see a figment, suck it up, soldier! After you That's get a reference me out from under this game. tooth! Alright, alright. Look at your panties and how Great job following orders, Private! <laughs> Coach! There were no teeth in Sasha's plan. That's what I told him. But he's all, no weapons, Molly. That's really funny. I didn't I didn't talk to him before. I didn't even know he said that. No, I mean, Sasha's implanted mental construct was just business office. Oh. This dental stuff. That's the real Dr. Lobato. Sasha's implant must be breaking down. We better double time it and decommission that dentist. How much dialogue did they give? Him? Should we investigate the area? No, this area is Fubar. We need to bug out. All right. 
I don't think we'll collect everything. I've, I've done that one time, and I think that's, that's as much as I would like to do it. But I can point out some little things when get to certain parts. Well, it's soldier through, Private. Unzip that dental door! Sorry if you guys have a problem with teeth. Here we go. Good job, soldier! What's that light? Uh-oh. Zip it back up again! Zip it! Yeah, now that your cap is clean, let's check out those choppers. Hmm. If I didn't know better, I'd swear this place had gremlins. No problem. I'm sure I can do this in the dark. Uh... <laughs> Coach... This room is definitely not in Sasha's plan. In fact, I think it's a trap. No. That's just a sensor. Everybody has those. You live in your mind and stamp out things that don't... belong. Like us? You handle this one. I'll find a way out. Yo, he just took off. He, he left me to fit for myself. Oh, oh whoa. Yeah. So you can use teleport to start the centers. So it's like the easy way of defeating no. them. No. Is that an emotional baggage? Just have to do your thing with the dental door here. Ugh. I can't even look at it. Uh, we're gonna grab some stuff. I'm not really trying to 100% anything, but we don't want to leave things hanging. Oh, look at that. I don't even know what it means, but look at it. Is that a picture of Dr. Lobato? Amazing. I'm so used to being able to levitate that not being able to is throwing me off. I wonder if you can... I'll go ahead and show you guys that setting. I don't know if you can levitate earlier, but we'll, we'll find out. So it's these two. Turn both of these on and you can use all four of your button presses or inputs for other powers. Again. Yeah, so you can't do it right now, but I'll show you guys what I mean when we unlock it. So blah blah blah, that, those tags are for the emotional baggage we'll be finding. So, like that guy. So you gotta find tags for these bags. It's just a collectible that can help you rank up if you get enough of them, or all of them. It plays this little song, which we'll be skipping every time because it's very annoying, even though it's a very adorable little scene. Yep. All right, coach, let's get on with it. Oops. All right, I didn't mean to grab your big fat head. Hey, see what you can find that way. See you on the other side. It looks like some sort of conference room in here. Rasputin, is that you? I need... Oof. I'm coming, Sasha. So there's a hole in this wall. When you get pyrokinesis, you can burn it. If you want to backtrack and grab whatever's in there, I don't remember. Oh, look at that. Rasputin, be careful. It's a... Ah, here's the hat box tag. Oh, look Someone that. is helping him. He hey, open Ooh. up. Please, Rasputin. That is not provided. I won't to let remind them eat you, Sasha. Thank you, Rasputin. Please, let's get clear of this aggressive uvula. Oh, wait, see that. <gasps> Sasha, how is Lobato breaking through the office construct? He couldn't be doing this on his own. He must be getting help from someone even more... sinister. Get ready, Rasputin. Oh, what am I? What am I doing? Am I blasting these guys to bits? Oh, wow! Keep moving forward, Mister. Ah. Sasha. I ooh, I've got the situation under our control. Ah, 
just find us a way out of here quickly. Yeah, don't bother with them, little mooks. You want to go for the gold. You got to grab the big boys. Help me carry this one, will you, Frankie? I thought they kept talking. I accidentally shot one Come of them on, too early. Frankie, put How a they do? Muscle into it. Huh, well, I eh. can't believe this shot Frankie. Oh. Hey, tooth fairies, drop that tooth. It's not yours, and I need to jump on it. So that's what I missed. All right. Ah, oh, they got me too, Frankie. The mooks. I have no idea what that mooks thing is about, so if someone wants to elaborate at some point in time, I would appreciate that. Oh, hold on. I want to I pick up some of these easier ones, maybe make the game a little bit easier, but like I said, we're not, we're not going to work. What's this say? Rage Breakdown? Boss? Trap? Hmm. Alright. Is this a mouth? Yeah. Did you even brush before you came in here today? Honestly, it's a mess in there. Here, rinse and spit. Oh no, not back in the trap. Trap? Coach? Coach, where'd he go? Oh, well, that's a good sign. What is it? That is a regret. If Lobato has regrets, then maybe there's a way we can still get to him. Let's get out of here and find Lobato. Uh, Sasha? <laughs> Are regrets dangerous? Oh yes, extremely. Take care of that one, will you, while I find an exit. He puts so much faith in Raz. So, give you guys a quick little trophy or achievement. You can grab, you use telekinesis to grab their uh, little weight here, and then throw it at it. And if you kill him with it, then you get, a, you get an achievement. I actually ended up beating this game with uh, 100% <laughs> before my platinum trophy and I still didn't do that. Mental energy is your health on the top left. Make sure you can that out. Little green orb still yet. I can't believe I didn't get that achievement right away. It seems just like so obvious to do. Especially against both of these enemies. Good job, Rasputin. Unfortunately, I can't find a way out of here anywhere. Uh, Sasha? How long has that golden door been there? Golden what? Did somebody say gold? Frankie, here's our chance for revenge! Oh, not these guys. I'll keep looking. I have no idea why they put him in this game. <laughs> Watch out! They're shooting at us! Frankie! Frankie? Oh no! What? You guys see? Did you guys see him up there? I wonder if that's a bug. They just did a patch today over yep. some like shading fixes and whatnot. Oh, well. oh, I missed. I missed twice. Not again! I'm coming to see you, ma. Rasputin, you see what you can find through that door. I'm going to stay here and attempt to repair my construct. Good luck, Sasha. It's all gone. Well, this is not getting any better. Raz, is that you? Come down here. Lily, I'm coming. I. Oh, oh I'm Hurry sliding. Up, here I'm I come. sliding. <laughs> I need to slap my butt. That's weird. Still got that water phobia, huh? It's not a phobia. It's a curse. 
Back in Grulovia, my whole family was cursed to die in water, and- Yeah, yeah, super sad. Look at these posters! How validating. I think someone else planted these in Lobato's mind to intimidate him. And make sure he didn't tell us who hired him to kidnap your dad. Let's get rid of that. Maybe it'll help. Help me burn these posters, Raz. So you can burn all of these to hear uh, extended dialogue from Lily. Or at least a lot of them. But uh, if I remember right... I'm gonna catch up to Lobato. Okay, I'll catch up after I make sure these posters are all burnt. Um, there's not an achievement or anything. So we can go ahead and just do this. Ah, fire! It hurts! Help me! Lily? That kind of freaked me out the first time. Oh, what? She moves to another... Hold on, I didn't know this was a thing. Keep going, Raz! Does she move again? She does. You got more fire in your head than I realized, Raz. So I'm kind of interested in all this dialogue that I'm about to see or not see. Okay, so I guess it's just the big thing. Oh, <sighs> I jumped right into the water. Alright. We're not here to hurt you. We just want to know who hired you to kidnap Truman Zanotto. Uh, why can't you just let it go? All's well that ends well, right? Hmm. Hmm. Sounds like there's some emotional baggage nearby. You think I should so? try to get that sorted. Oh, sure thing. Yeah, yeah, we are, we already know. If you don't know, you can pause the video. Or the district. <laughs> I promise that's yep. gonna play a thousand times. <laughs> can I not? Can I not? Can I not get that? You. <sighs> we had to almost kill ourselves for it, but you made it, so it's fine. What a bumblebee. <laughs> This. Oh. This, room. this is uh, not good. Who are you protecting? Myself. Huh. Oh, that's right. So that that picture I told you to I burn. Need the purse tag here. Um, earlier on that by that table. That's where you find this purse tag. All right. Goodbye, Lobato. Was that you screaming? Or me? Doesn't matter. Listen, we all have our doubts and regrets. But it's too late to turn back now. Understand? What we have to do now is finish the extraction. Lily, I think Lobato is starting to have doubts. Duh. They're right over there. Luckily, they're highly flammable! You take care of them while I find a way out, okay? Highly flammable, huh? I'll see about that. Oh, yeah. Those things can really slow you down! Now, the farther you get in this game, the more you'll realize that they have made the item to a pill. Oh, these are like, these are like health items. That you can use whenever. But they made the fighting to appeal to more uh, the people I think who played the first game. Because it can just get kind of hard at times. A lot of people have been struggling with crowd control, but I haven't really had that issue. If you just remember the enemy's weaknesses, you won't really. I don't know. It might be too much at times, but it shouldn't be that bad. Not bad enough for you to be missing <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
titanium. That's just um, money, pretty much. Hey, Raz, doesn't this painting look familiar? Get away from me, you scary little girl! Think we should burn it? Oh, you haven't changed, have you? Come on, just tell us who hired you to kidnap my dad. Oh, this is really personal for you, isn't it? You better believe it is. Well, I'm sorry if you were offended. That does it. I'm burning this guy. Wait, wait. I'll tell you. Uh, yes? The person who hired me. Yes? Was no one. No one hired me because I didn't do anything. Oh, brother. Well, not on purpose, at least. It was an accident. You've got to be kidding me. Your father got lost and ended up in the rhombus of ruin on accident. Uh, and I was just trying to help him rest while we waited for you to come save him. Nice try. Mm. Oh, I don't even care anymore. Do your worst. <sighs> so I never talked to Lily in this part because I just didn't think he could. So here we go. Maybe we could get some information from Lobato here. This flimsy projection is worthless. I say we burn them all until we find one who tells us who hired him to kidnap my dad. Huh? Maybe all? we could get some information yeah. from the this flimsy yeah. pig. I huh? okay. Let's continue. <laughs> oh no, you don't. I think I just did. <laughs> Yes, darling. Nothing. Did you forget everything I taught you about levitation, Rasputin? No. Your thoughts can lift you up if you focus. Better mm. hurry before we hit the ground. Can I just fall? Okay, so right now L2 is levitation, so you go. I'll use that. For now. now let's get out of here. The needs and now I'll yes. show you guys. Wait. Help Lobato. Someone way. really did a number on that poor thing. I think he wants to tell us who hired him, but he's terrified. Let's find him and help him. So right now you can use L2, right? And you can use it to roll on a ball, but it's not like you do that right now. But with those two settings, you can glide by triple clicking X and holding them this the third time. And if you click it four times, then it will turn into the ball and you can roll it. Thus giving you the space for all of your powers. It's very useful. I'm gonna turn off the setting because even though everyone loves it, I I don't actually like it. It I like that it reminds me of the first game. What I don't like is that you do it all with the X button, and I'm not cool with that. <laughs> I actually don't mind it taking up the space because I don't know. I feel like switching powers is kind of part of the game, so I I enjoy it regardless. Wow. Some people say some of the platforming part. I, there's a couple moments where it's a little weird, but I wouldn't say enough to talk about. More like, maybe it's weird to get used to at first, I would say. Like, the amount of distance you travel is what's kind of weird. But you get in the habit of holding X or cross at the time, and it's really cross. Sony says cross, but that's just what you do. If you do little baby jumps, you don't get that far. If you do long ones, like if you hold it, you'll go a lot faster. Versus just a little tap. Right. Look how full of that poor Calicosto is. Mia's mine. There's a, not in this game, I'm referring back to Psychonauts 1, there's a place where you do all her levitation and stuff, and you find out that she used to work at like a nursery, and she went to get, oh, get groceries one time, and when she comes back, the nursery is on fire, and her brain's like going crazy, and she can hear all the crying screams from her children, and uh, not her children, but everyone in the nursery, all the kids in the nursery that she's trying to protect, and it's... It's a little heart-wrenching. Yep. Find it in a vault. And it's just kind of like, wow. She just has to live with that this for the rest way. of her life. 
I might have mentioned that in my first YouTube video on my Twitch update, but if I didn't, now you guys know. I'm kind of interested to see how speedrunners would do this game. Ah, here we go. Mia, the mission is falling apart. We've lost control of Lobato. There's a little chaos on every mission, Raz. A psychonaut must always remember how to roll with it. You remember how to gather your thoughts and roll with them, right? Alright, so this is what I'm talking about. If you hit X three times. Alright, let me see. Okay, I guess it's making me use L2 first, but. You could just use L2, but if you want that extra power slot, you can uh, triple click X. I don't know why it's not working. Oh, it's just because I turned those settings off. Yeah, so. Just, just hit X a bunch of times, <laughs> and it'll work. Um, these are like mental connection things. We can come back here later to continue clicking things. Oh, I lied. I think the first tag is down there. There's videos on the internet about how to 100% everything. Also, the speedrunner thing. When you levitate in the first game, if you reach a certain frame rate on PC, you can keep spamming this bubble and this like ball thing in a way to make you float endlessly like into the sky. And it really helps you choose some areas. Did I just kill myself? Oh my god. Regardless, you can't do it in this game, which is why I'm interested in how people would figure out. I'm sure it still uses the ball. Oh yeah, we have to let's go down here. This ball protects you from all kind of hazardous floors, as you can see from the top left. But, water, because Raz cannot deal with water. I know the reason. With the curse, you guys will know that if you play the whole game. I'm not worried about these techniques. Also, don't levitate there. If you do that, you will fall to your death. You, you won't be able to get back on the ball. And will Mia? Mia, I'm coming! Oh my god, I did this the first time too! The ones with fall guys, they can't really see the, the gap. Mia? Where are you? Oh, there's a tag over here. Sasha, I can't reach Mia. I think she's been dementistrated. Suitcase tag. Gotcha. I actually missed this tag the first time I played this, and I was really surprised. Because I, I was trying to 100% this as soon as I started. I just was going to. I was going to finish it first and get what I, anything I saw, but anything I've seen, excuse me. But it didn't work out that way. So I had to go back and find some stuff. Also, a neat little trick that the game doesn't mention. If you. What oh. am I supposed to do again? It's him! I've got to stop him! No. 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 In the basket, in the basket in the ocean. No, no, that's not it. Put the old box in the basket and the egg in the ocean. You put the egg in the basket and the old egg in the box 
and the box in the ocean. <laughs> Simple. And if you tell anyone about me, anyone at all, you'll have to deal with her. No, not her. Please don't make me look at her again. No, no, I won't tell. I won't tell anyone. I promise. No, please. She was looking kind of scary. Raz is just free falling. This is an old loading screen, by the way. I don't remember if Raz was falling during it, but just a spinny green background here. No, not her. I won't kill. That bozo's brain was booby trapped. Yes, whoever hired Lobato to kidnap Truman knew he might be psychically interrogated. The poor thing looks terrified. Did anyone get a good look at his boss? I saw him, but I couldn't tell who he was. And I saw... something else. I saw the thing that terrified Lobato. It was... a woman, dressed in black fur. She was floating over the ruins of a city, and she was commanding serpents of... water. There was something familiar about her. Rasputin, I'm going to show you a picture. That's her! Wait a second. I thought I recognized her. True Psychic Tales, issue 43. She's on the cover. Maligula. The deluge of Grulovia. Maligula? She's been dead for 20 years! Ford Crawler killed her himself! A battle from which he never truly recovered. She was a monster. A ruthless, power-hungry psychic who drowned hundreds of her own countrymen. Nevertheless, she still has her loyal followers to this day. This file documents recent activity believed to be the work of these modern-day delusionaries. What are they up to? Well, it's ridiculous, really. There's no scientific basis to... Necromancy. What? They're trying to bring her back to life? It's silly, darling, but if they believe they can do it, they might do some dangerous things. Mia, have you considered the other disturbing fact in all of this? That unstable character. Could Beat never it. kidnap the grand head Get of lost. the Psychonauts without help? Yes. You mean... There's a mole in the Psychonauts. You think this is a mole, you're dumber than you look. Approaching the mother lobe. Agent Forsyth, why did you deny us intel when we hailed the Motherlobe? What are you talking about, Agent Nine? 
We were on a mission to rescue the Grand Head of the Psychonauts. When we called for assistance... I never heard any call. Who did you talk to? Is he all right? We won't know for sure until we get that squirrel tested for rabies. This is our kidnapper. Clearly, he had help on the inside. Impossible. A mole in the Psychonauts? We have reason to believe delusionists are involved. And they're trying to bring back Malikula. What? I know. Isn't it great? The Psychonauts haven't had this kind of a threat in years. Can someone help me with my dad? He's still acting funny. Truman! Let's get him inside so he can lie down. I'll see what I can find out in my meditation chamber. I'm taking Lobato to my office for further interrogation. I'm gonna talk to Otto about our military options. Does that make anyone else a little nervous? Who are you? I'm Raz. Uh, Rasputin? I'm, uh, your newest psychonaut? How's that? Ford Crowley, he gave me a badge. I've been kind of helping out. <laughs> Listen, kid. Agent Crowler is a hero. But he's not operating at 100%. He can hand out all the merit badges he wants, but he doesn't have the authority to commission psychonauts. But you can, right? You're Hollis Forsyth, lesser head of the psychonauts? True Psychic Tales 146. You and Truman fought the noodler together. I prefer the title, Second Head. If the other agents vouch for you, I might be able to get you a spot. In the intern program. But don't be late for orientation. I hear the coordinator's a real brain buster. Welcome to the mother lobe. All right. Let's keep going. <clears throat> hey, is it okay if I go up into the main headquarters now? I'm sorry, little boy, but there just aren't any school tours today. What? I'm an intern. Agent Forsyth gave me this. Really? Let's check your head in the thinkerprint reader, please. <laughs> Well, I'll be doused. Welcome to the intern program. Let me get you your orientation materials. Okay, so this stuff seems like a lot, but I promise it's not. <laughs> you could really get by wow. this whole thing with that uh, picture really captures my startled. Just stuff. a couple, a couple of these. I'll keep my to-do list here. Quick. Okay, so. This is just all your unique collectibles, right? This is all your upgrades for power-ups. When you rank up, you unlock these credits to upgrade your powers. And you can max all of these out if you get every single thing in the game. Uh, this is your map. You can click on it and see pieces and things that you've missed. And your critical missions. And there will eventually be one for optional missions. There's only like three to five, I think, in this whole game. So, really nothing to sweat about. Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. Oh, thank you. You know, there might actually be a kooky way to speedrun this game on PC. Because I'm thinking if the frame rate was like something that helped a lot in the first one maybe the frame rate can do something else in this one because i've accidentally like spam clicked some buttons and kind of gotten a little higher than i should have been able to so i don't know maybe maybe there's an actual way to do it still and i'm sure if there is speedrunners will figure it out eventually i always wondered if this was a spot somewhere in the game this, like, brain with all these little TV screens. But I don't know. Because I've never seen it. <laughs> wow! I can't 
can't believe I'm really here! Psychonauts headquarters! Ow! Sorry, new ball. Wow! Alright, so we're gonna go bother so I want to point out a few things right here. This automatic has all the psychic supplies and enhancements. You that guy needs to shut up. All right, so the astral lanes, the yep. Ford's haircut place, and the Meldrum currently are inaccessible. Excuse me, but do you know where intern orientation is? Second floor, past the classroom. Thanks. If you pass the restrooms, you went the wrong way. What, are we recruiting from kindergartens now? If she doesn't find a way to let off some Dang. steam soon, she's going to crack. There's someone she who said something kind of funny here. Hey, Let me see if I can we find all? Her. Maybe it's... Oh, gosh. More cutscenes. Wow. Here they are. The Psychic Six. The group of paranormal experts Ford Crowler gathered together to form the Psychonauts. I read all about them in True Psychic Tales, number one. Tragically, none of them were the same after fighting Maligula in the Deluge of Grulovia. Less tragically, but still upsetting, my mom used that issue of True Psychic Tales to line the floor of the world's smallest horse trailer. Go figure. So I think it's this chick right here. No, it's not you. Where, where, where are you? Maybe, maybe one of you. No, no. See you. All right. Attention, so. all interns. If you do not have a mentor oh, we don't, we don't yet, need please mentor report to my office for immediately for assignment. So the Doesn't automatic get in the way thing of your down here waves? is a shop. If I think it's called side cores, we'll go over that. We'll have a look around. This. Yeah, well, yeah, 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 yeah. So these can help you rank up if you get nine side cards. You buy one of these, and you rank up. It's pretty simple. It sells candy that heals you, and dream fluffs that heal you only when you lose all of your health completely, and pouches for wallets, dream fluffs, and side cards. Got it? Got all covered? Just wallets for different items. And, and the uh, cores. With that being said, look at this free idea. one. Let's make a side challenge marker. And we'll go to this side that says combine on the left hand side. We'll do that. He'll give us one free one. It just it just helps us right here. Yeah. And then there's pins that give you diff just different build things, you know, like this one changes all your levitation balls and colors. And then there's ones for different power upgrades. It's pretty self-explanatory. If you played it the Paper Mario games, you might be familiar with something similar. So we're gonna go with we're gonna go with green because I got a blue one the first time. Just what I was going to recommend. Okay, so so much cool that. stuff in there. And that I'll star later for the rest. can be applied to any of these abilities to get upgrades. That's that's the complicated part of all of the menus. So, the person I was trying to find, if you say hi to them, she'll be like, "Sorry, I just hate kids." And it looks like this girl. Ford Crawler. Oh my god. I want to and a close personal friend of mine, I might add. Right, we're, we're skipping that. Alright, so side cards. We're not going through all of them. I just want to point out some of them in this area. There's a lot around the ground. There was one by the automatic. One by the bush here. There's some you can actually kind of cheese up there. You can't get the ones on the side unless you're crazy with these ball. And you also need an upgrade. But that's how you can cheat one of them. I did that just goofing off. Um, let's see if we can get this one. Yeah. Got a side card. Doesn't that helmet get in the way of your mental waves? I'll take that card. Once again, we're not 100%ing this, but we might. You might want to grab what's around. <laughs> no reason not to level up. You can find titanium by pressing triangle. A lot of people say it's really hard to find, but the second you're, you great, ah, I can't speak. You get access to go outside. Shouldn't you you can class? find a bunch, like everywhere. <laughs> You'll like literally have too much to even know what to do with it. <laughs> I recommend spending the first 75 you get inside on a wallet. 
And with all that being said, let's proceed with the cutscenes, the game, and all that fun stuff. Oh wait, there's Lily right here. Let's, let's talk to her. Can I do anything to help Lily? Yeah, keep me from killing Jared here. I know too many of his weak points. I'm sure they'll let you up soon. I need to get up there right now so I can start Dad's psych herb therapy. I'm sure your dad's going to be okay, Lily. Raz, I don't know. He just feels all wrong. I'm worried all that Silurium we found him with in the Rhombus Ruin did some damage. Why won't they let you upstairs? I don't know. Psychic sanitation or something? They put me in the intern program. Are you in there too? Raz, I've been training here since before I could walk. I tested out of all that stuff. Hey, can we... Uh... What? Nothing. I clicked on that one really quick. He said, uh, can we talk about the time that we kissed in the first game, pretty much? So, in case you didn't get a chance to read that, that's what he said. This mole stuff is weird, huh? What's gonna happen? Oh, please. I've been around here my whole life. And trust me, nothing ever happens. Do you remember the last time you said that? Don't you know some secret passages around here you could use? Tons of them! But everyone's got mole madness right now, so everything's on double lockdown. Are you sure there's nothing I can do to help? Well, actually... Would you mind if I... Could I just... Anything. Can I just punch you in the shoulder really hard? Of course. Ugh. Thanks. That helped. Anytime. Well, I better get to intern orientation. You'll like Hollis, I think. She's strict, but deep down, she's really serious. Okay. I'm not a visitor. I practically grew up in this building, so, Jared. So, this is a pretty big learning point for Raz. We'll walk around a bit more. Just cause, like, Find stuff. that mole yet, kid? You order anything? No. Oh, also, this is a cool little thing. Bacon. The guy over here, there's all these agents in Milkman's area in the first game. This guy has the voice of that guy. It's kind of interesting. Listen to him. Wow! You agents share recipes? You're just like us. Uh, yeah. Right. Recipes. Agent. Intern. But yeah, you might you might notice that he has the exact same voice as the agent. <laughs> I was really stoked about it. I was like a happy little child. Can't yes. leave this card lying around. I'm happy that he's in here versus not being in here at all, you know? Psycar! I love oh, these yeah. things. I don't have a key. Well, let's get a key. So there's a... Interesting, there's a scavenger hunt, and there's an item you can pick up from right here, but I always thought this guy was, like, using it with his mind or something. So I completely missed it. It was, it was really dumb. Also, there's a there's a bathroom here that you can change your outfit in. I think you have to beat the game first. Uh, you are a honey pepper fool. A what? Ooh. So, what's good today? Why do I bother making signs? All right, that's me at my job. Let's keep going. If you need a big win, come down and get a performance enhancing pin. Oh, we can go talk to the agents. Let's let's do that. Real quick. Yeah. Up all this. Hello. Not now, kid. Busy. With what? With staring at fish? Fuck off. <laughs> Got it. Also, why we're talking about scavenger stuff? You need to get a nameplate. You actually get it from this door. But mind you, that's still a little bit after where we're at. Got these side cards. This is Mia's place, by the way. If you couldn't tell. With her floating in the complete aesthetic. Ah, there's a key. I'll bet this key goes to that supply chest I found. Is this a bad time, Mia? I always have time for my kid in genio. Are you worried about Maligula? Well, she died in the Battle of Grulovia, but sometimes the idea of someone is more dangerous than the person themselves. Her followers are what scare me. 
When someone devotes their life to a memory, they're capable of anything. Are you meditating? In a way. I'm reaching out to detect ripples in the psychic network around the world. What are you doing that for? I'm trying to find the illusionist activity around the world and report it to Agent Forsyth down in the nerve center. Ripples? A name like Maligula carries heavy emotional baggage for many people. It's like a large stone dropped in a pond. Ripples spread out, bounce off each other. If you know how to read the patterns, they can lead you to the source. Can I ask you about the Psychic Six? Of course, Rasputin. Are any of them still around? Oh, yes. Besides Ford, you know, there's Otto Mentalis out in his workshop, still tinkering with his gadgets. Sasha is his number one customer. Dogen Bull's grandfather, Compton, is here as well, but he... he keeps to himself. The other survivors have gone their own ways, unfortunately. What happened to... Helmet Fulbear? Oh, that poor soul was lost in the Battle of Grulovia. I wish I could have met him. He seemed to have such a love of life. And color. Did you ever meet Cassiopeia? No, but I read her book, Mindswarm. Very inspiring. I'm actually using some of her multitasking techniques right now, talking to you while I work. Did you ever work with Lily's great uncle, Bob Zanotto? Oh yes, poor Bob. He lost so much in the battle, it really took a toll on him. I know it was very difficult for Truman to let him go, but it was getting dangerous. Oh, what that poor family has endured. Well, enough about those guys. Yes, let's talk about us. Have you talked to Sasha lately? Sasha and I are always talking. Oh, he says hello. Well, I'll stop bothering you now. Never a bother, right. darling. Ciao. Later, Mia. Let's go see what Sasha's up to. Literally right next door. If you would just cooperate with our investigation. Oh, I'd like to, but I can't. I know you. Need any help, Sasha? Yes, from him. Me? Help me find the answers I need. Oh, so this is all my fault. Have any suspicions? No, that's the frustrating thing. How could anyone in the Psychonauts do this? And how could they keep it a secret? Maybe he just hatched this scheme on his own? He has no motivation. Oh, hello, Dad. Someone hired him, and, given his access to Truman, someone on the inside. That hello, Dad thing is really funny <laughs> to me. Anyways, let's let's continue. So about Maligula. She's dead, Rasputin. Ford Kruller made sure of that. Nothing for you to worry about. At least we made it out of the rhombus of ruin. You performed well in the field, Rasputin. I'll make sure Agent Forsyth finds out all about it in my report. Just as soon as I'm done here. Why do you think he won't cooperate? He seemed to have such a big change of heart back in the rhombus. Someone has conditioned him, hypnotically, to be unable to tell us, even if he wanted to. But who? I'll let you get back to the interrogation. Sorry I can't help. You've done a lot, Rasputin. Thank you. Sasha 9's really considerate. More power? This is a brain tumbler. It can take you to the collective consciousness mind thing. You'll know what I'm talking about at some point in time, but we're not going to go over it now. I don't blame you for... I had an issue where Dr. Lobato would keep talking no matter where I went, and only like closing out the entire game fixed it. Like, shut up. I don't need to hear you in someone else's mind. Who are these people? Hey, look out! Oh, sorry, I didn't... Whoa! Ow! That's mean! Did he hurt you, baby? I'm not a baby. Yeah, you are. Question is, who's this new kid? My name is Raz, and I'm the new intern. That's ridiculous. I didn't ask for a new intern. Intern program's full. Sorry, kid. He is clumsy. He'd probably get us all killed. 
And he's mean. Well, kid, we give it a fair shot, and it looks like it just didn't work out. Better luck next year. Guys, quit picking on the new kid. We were all new ones, in case you forgot. I think he'll fit in just fine. In fact, I think he'll look cute in our uniform. Let's take him to the closet. Hey, you okay in there, Rusty? What's the holdup? It's Raz. I was just wondering, if there's an intern uniform, how come you guys aren't wearing it? Oh, well, we're level two. Now just hand out your clothes and we'll get you that uniform. Well, can't you hand me the uniform first? <laughs> no, silly. We need to take your clothes and measure them so we can get you a uniform that fits. Unless you want us to come in there and measure you. No, no. Here you go. Just hurry up, okay? It's cold in here and I'm practically naked. Uh-oh. Guys? Oh, come on! This is embarrassing in so many ways. Damn, Raz. <laughs> Raz straight up got played. I feel kind of bad. A bunch of bullies. I missed that side card the first time I did my playthrough. I was really surprised. Because I was very thorough in my search. It was the only one I missed. Oh, was that? That was Cassiopeia. That's cool. Alright. Door. Anything up there? No? Alright. We don't need to spend too much time here. Ooh, let's open it. We got one of those keys earlier. I saw something that said don't look closely at the Titanium. And now I've been wondering for a while if it's supposed to be someone's, like, the shape is supposed to be someone's nose. That's, that's all that comes to mind when I see it. There's this other key we can use it for the opposite one I used on the crate. Alright, let's, let's go in here. I don't know the code. Rats! Oh, sorry, Harold. You're absolutely right. I should think about how I'm using that word. What is it, Harold? Do you know the code? Is the code in there, Harold? I'm too big to go in there. If only I could see what you see in there. Hey, that reminds me. Good old clairvoyance. We can see what we look like through other people's eyes. It's a really cool ability. Yeah, yeah, I know how to switch these. I've been doing this a while. Time to see the world as you see, Harold. How does Harold see me? Aw, I'm a giant rat. That's nice, I guess. I guess. Aha! That's it, Harold. Hey, let's go. Oh, here we are. I didn't really know uh, what direction. Oh no. Oh yikes! All right, we're just we're just gonna make our way. That was easy. To have to worry about anything. We got it right where we want him, yet we still can't extract the information we need. Have you tried? Oh, I should have let that played out a bit more. Sasha, you have to let me do more. You know it's because of me that. Arto. I mean, if I hadn't. Not a word, Rasputin, until I find you some new clothes. Sorry if the fit is a little off. They're the smallest clothes I had. Now, uh, tell us again how you ended up outside in your underwear. Oh, you know, I, I was sort of going undercover. Just like you did, Agent Mentalis, in True Psychic Tales number 62, when you used your defibrillator to hypnotize 16 trans troopers at once. Oh, please, that old yarn. Oh, they embellished so many details in that version. But in fact, it was 17 troopers. Well, love to chat, but uh, I gotta make like a brain and bounce. If you're ever looking for just the right tool for the job, come see me in my workshop. Even the best psychonauts require a little assistance now and then. Now, if you'll excuse me, Rasputin, I 
I need to get back to the matter at hand. No, oh, no. I didn't bend the spoons, Mommy. Ooh, I love going through the car wash. Oh, and don't worry about the other interns, Rasputin. Initiation rituals are a common method for a specialized social group to integrate foreign elements while preserving the social exclusivity of that group. Understand? Uh... <laughs> Dominant <Thanks, laughs> excuse me. <laughs> I did get his car wash thing the first time, and now it makes sense Nothing because all those like about. purple psychic lines were like kind of rubbing his head like a car wash. <laughs> that's that's sorry. Funny. I hope that didn't hurt. No, oh, what? How did I miss this? A psychor right up here. Time. More intern credits for me. Oh yeah. I thought that was a chest. I always think this is a chest. I walk by here and I try mind. to open it all the time. I'm going to try <laughs> one more time. Clairvoyance. I'm Thank a you. secret agent. You can use clairvoyance to find secret spots for money. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and buy a wallet. That should be the first thing you do. That was a dirty trick you pulled. I want my clothes back. You know you're right. I'm sorry. And I'm going to make it up to you. I'm going to let you finish my asset recovery mission. Why do I feel like I'm gonna end up naked in a closet again? My intern assignment is to track down this list of missing Psychonaut assets. Mission critical assets. So, like a scavenger hunt? If you think like a child, you will do a child's work. Finish this mission, and we'll know you're ready for your clothes back. Okay, so... <laughs> This is funny to me. There's not a lot of optimal missions. Optimal. Optimal. I said optimal. Optimal. Optional. Oh my god. I'm, this looks like a I'm good forfeiting place to life. Alright. But that's where you would look. It's at the last page. So there you go. And this is where you hmm. put pins. If you want to take pins. a look at that. It's right here. I need all the pins. But uh, with all that being said, we're just going to move forward. There's not I'm a lot really of optional missions in this game. Now. I better get to the class right away. You can also talk to this guy, he's like, cause he's kind of involved in the bowling, and he'll go over a little bit of the history with you. Uh, I'm not going to do that. I've done that before, but I recommend that you guys. It's it's not too important, honestly. It's it's not boring. It's just not needed. Up. Turn them into side challenge markers with oh, actually, a core from the auto magic. Go ahead and buy that wallet. I'll show you what the the very It's it's this guy. That'll get you out of a sticky situation. Oh, we also have ten cores, so we can also Let's combine that side core. Core with your card so you can okay, find it. And then we rank up. It's not as it's not as complicated as you would think. <laughs> and since we're doing all this and I'm rank six already, I'll go ahead and show you guys how this works. Um I kinda wanna have some fun with this, so we'll we'll rank up everything once. So now we can do an attack after we dodge. Now we can throw to hit what's that? Find objects. Force more damage. Okay, that does more damage. What's this one do? Hold the charger blast for a bigger explosion. I've ha had this fully upgraded, and I never knew that. Go figure. My side blast feels a lot blastier. Yeah, yeah. Nothing like a little clairvoyance boost. I don't shot. recommend doing them on everything, feels but like I got a little more spring. Just kind of pick what you want at first. It's not. It's not that bad. So let's let's see what that's about. Real quick. I've never used this. Oh, look at that. Cool. What? That goes so far. How do, oh my god, I went through the whole game without that? God. Austerity measures, Oleander. Every department is affected. Once I get my pirate my radio station going, no Did time someone say something bad. about pirate radio? You think no. This is yes. Saving you money? Morris is doing it, it and it's totally to against me. Lizzie, you're free, Mon. Okay, they're, they're too busy talking in the office. Way. We're gonna go there first. Get a hold of yourself, Oleander. Fighting Maligula without my battle fight, cheapskates. Hey, I'm with you. Letting him build a battle anything is probably a bad idea. Oh, right, new intern. Thought I told you not to be late. Doesn't matter. You need a mentor. Let me see who's left. Ooh, am I helping Mia? 
or Sasha on a mission? No. You're in the mailroom. Your mentor is Nick John Smith. Mailroom? Nick John Smith? I've never heard of an Agent John Smith. Nick's not an agent. He's not even psychic. He's just good at sorting mail. You'll love Nick. Everybody does. But the mailroom? Ford Crowler himself worked in that mailroom. You could learn a lot there. For one thing, how to be on time. Okay, I've given you fingerprint access to the mailroom. Now scoot, I've got a base to run and a budget to balance. All right, let's make our way to the mailroom. Oh, oh well. What if you jump up? No, it's, there's glass. There's glass. Hey! Uh, how's your dad? Terrible! I gotta go get him some therapy plants stacked. How'd you get that hatch open? Oh, it's got a fingerprint combination. I can teach it to you. Come here. It's more than just a number. You kind of have to feel it. Do you feel it? Yes. Good. Tell anybody you got it from me, and you're dead. Bye! I totally forgot the name of this, but there you go, Autobahn. That's what we're calling it anyway. B-O-N. Hey! It's good for fast travel, honestly. I use it all the time. What were you doing? Classroom, mailroom, Nick Johnson. Yeah, that's great. Got some new Scanning. gadgets available in my it. shop for testing. Uh, I mean for purchase. They're totally safe. Not available to interns, obviously. Mr. John Smith? Hello? New intern here. Is that her? Ah. Oh, God. Oh, look at that. Mine? I'll give you all of them. Up there. Oh. oh, look, there's a sidecar. Oh, a god, mess. it's everything. Yoink. There's literally a lot up here. And down there. Side challenge markers are like a hobby of mine. Hurry! Got a sidecar. What? Everything okay in here? Who are you? I'm, uh, Nick John Smith's new intern. Oh, so you're the one not sorting all this mail. Wait! Better get all this mail sorted, quick! You're making Nick look bad. Alright, well, I guess we have to sort some mail, but, uh, not before grabbing these parts. Wow, let me in, let me in. Oh, look at that. Uh -huh. Alright, let's sort this smell. This box? Oh, it's green, so. Aha! I'm a genius. Boring. What? That's not what happened! Why is this one? Oh, there is red. What? Oh my god. Is this orange? That's orange. This is green. This package is addressed to Truman Zanotto. Hey, this might be important. I'd better bring it to Truman. Technically, this is official Psychonauts business. All right, Raz, whatever Heavy. you say. What the heck did Truman order here? Sorry, Truman. Oh, whoops. Alley-oop. 
It's weird, so if you hold R2 and then let go, it will grab it and then chuck it. But if you just click R2, it automatically assumes you're clicking it, and it just continues to hold it. So you don't actually have to hold R2. I've kind of gotten in the bad habit of it. Also, you can use more than one psychic power at a time, which is really nice. Come on, Raspy. What the? Hey, you guys gotta check this out. The new kid killed Nick. He's alive, but he's brainless. <gasps> what kind of sick monster would steal Nick's brain? I mean, Nick! Maybe he saw something he shouldn't have. But why keep his body alive? And why mail it to the Grand Head of the Psychonauts? It could be a warning. Hey guys, does the Lady Lucktopus Casino mean anything to you? Isn't that where we sent Agent 33? To investigate suspected delusionist activity? Agent 33 is two days late with her status update. I'll get the jet. I'll pack the go case. I'll stay here and protect the children. What? Aren't we all going on the mission? We could use you in tactical command, Agent Forsyth. And maybe the interns would benefit from... It's not safe. Not while we have a double agent among us. I'll take her place. I've heard the buffet there is shockingly reasonable. Well, if you reconsider, meet us on the jet pad within the hour. Can't we just... No, all of you. To the intern's bay. Now. I've got some training exercises planned today that are both informative and safe. Last one there has to delouse the brain tumbler. TV? I'll bet those guys took Nick's body back to the mail. I should go check and see if he's okay. <sighs> he is my mentor after all. Scanning access. Alright, let's go see if Nick is fine. Oh, is that a card? I'll take that card. We've already got 16 out of 27. That's that's oh, wonderful. Oh, 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 oh. Nick? Nick! Wrong oh, wrong. Oh. Alright, well I, I I guess it's fine. That's what you call being fine. That's cool. Or honestly. He just wants to watch some TV. bothering you just thinking about Nick you know oh that's right he mailed that letter for you that one time didn't he hey don't worry we're going to find Nick's brain it's just he was so so great at sorting mail you know I'll sort your mail Colin what I'm sorry I don't know what I'm saying all right we're using clairvoyance on these people oh she's she's in love with him Alright. Hi! Hey, cutie! Alright. I didn't look at Raz. She just called me cutie, but I look like a vending machine for cigarettes? Huh. I wonder if anyone goes into this a bit more. I'm very interested in knowing what this is about. He kind of looks like a weird... He's basically cigarette BMO. Alright. What about you? Bacon? Oh, is that me? I'm a bacon fiend? Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so he doesn't know anything about her liking him yet. Experts agree. It's just not safe to use he, He's basically oblivious. Without my special clairvoyance... Oh, good. Bins. You're finally here. Let yeah. me know when you're prepared to learn something. Ah, right now. I'm, I'm ready right now. <clears throat> If I may speak... You may not. Class is in session. 
Can I ask? Please hold all questions till the end of the lesson. Agent Foresight. That mission is being handled by experienced psychonauts. Do not bring it up again. When does class start? As soon as you get to my classroom. This isn't your classroom? No. This is. So are you ready, kid? Yeah. And what are you ready for? Safety. Oh, you think the human mind is safe? Well, that's cute. is how you perform the advanced psychic ability known as Mental Connection. Cool! Ooh, sorry, could you repeat that? Sorry, kid. I warned you not to be late. I'm off to attend to some fiduciary concerns. Norma, take over for me, won't you? You can practice with some of those loose ideas. But, Agent Forsyth, is it safe to leave all these thoughts out like this if you're not here? Norma, please. It takes more than a few rambunctious children to affect the mind of a trained psychonaut. Try not to fall asleep in my class. All right, Repscallion. Okay, now how do I explain mental connection extremely simply? Let me guess. We focus on an idea in someone's mind until we form a tangible connection with it. Oh, I didn't realize you were a mental connection expert. By all means, give us a demo. Professor. And we will do that probably tomorrow <laughs> or Let's Sunday. Let's go. I'm just a little bit but, bored. But for now, we're, we're done. Thanks for coming to the stream, having a good time, small visits, all that good if stuff. If he does this wrong, we'll he could die. Guys. What? Hold on. <laughs> I can what? <laughs> all right. Anyways, I will see all Show of you guys later. Show us how you later. make a mental connection with...